What's up you guys, I'm Anna back with another video and today I am going to be sharing my experience at the TWICE concert. A lot, a lot happened but I am wearing their merch, I don't know if you can see it. Before I get into detail with anything, um, it was such a blessing and an awesome experience just to attend this concert. I know I didn't get the best seating in the world but I was there, I experienced it and I would have so much fun and I was so so happy yeah let's get a little bit of detail on on like the whole experience thing the whole thing was such a mess like the whole State Farm Arena like they need to get their act together I just want to let you guys know I live about 25 minutes away from the stadium so it's not that far of a drive from where I live so yeah so I left my house around 4 30 got there like probably around 5 we had stood in line not even kidding you for three hours you guys it was so so bad and the concert started at 7 30 we didn't get inside till like close to eight or eight o'clock there were so many lines that we we didn't even know where to go we asked the staff they're like there's a line here there's a line here there's a line here that that wasn't really helpful yeah but the line that i was in was not moving at all everybody else was getting in we were in two lines merging into one close to three hours we were standing in line for it was so crazy i was texting my friend that was able to get in like has it started has it started i'm over here panicking that what if i missed them coming up i was like please like i was i was such a mess i was like oh my god i don't want to miss anything i like i kept texting her i was like please let me know if it starts please let me know and i didn't want to use my phone because i didn't want the battery to die so i'm just i was like panicking at this point it was like probably 7 45 to like the staff kind of rushed us like around the building to the front of the gate once they told us to go to the front because there's nobody there like this whole line we all ran and when i tell you i've never ran so fast in my life before i took off and um you guys i went to the concert with my brother and my sister-in-law my brother injured his ankle my brother was limping to the front like i took off i told them i was like i'm so sorry but you guys are not gonna drag me down <laughs> with my brother's limping like i'm sorry that i left him behind but i was not about to miss twice because he was limping and bringing me down but then he had to catch up because i had the tickets and i wasn't slowing down for i think the last time i ate something was at 10 30 or 11 in the morning and i had to use the restroom while i was in line but when i tell you once they told us to like go in all of that went away the need to go to the bathroom the need to eat the need to do anything else but to get to my seat it just all went away and of course my seat was in the third floor so you can either take the steps or there's escalators and my poor brother we had to take the escalators because he caught up and he had injured his ankle while you know trying to get to the front you know i was so tired from standing up for three hours that finally when we got in i had sat down for you know just a little bit and not even a minute la later they had came out and i jumped on my feet and i was ready for it oh my god and yeah this is where things start getting messy for me anything i do there's always something bad that happens along i had batteries for my luna light stick which is in the back i didn't have time to buy some batteries for my candy bong so i just took the batteries that i had from there and put them on in my candy bong mind you i don't use my luna light stick so it's just there it's just there collecting dust so i was like you know what May the batteries should still be good so maybe 15 minutes in the concert you know i'm with my light stick singing dancing you know with my light stick and then and I connected to the Candy Bong app, you know, so I can turn my light stick green for Jung Young. Bro, it said batteries low. At this point, I wanted to cry. I wanted to cry. Like, you guys, I was so mad at myself. I'm like so dumb for not getting batteries. But I literally thought that I was like, you know what? I don't need them because, like I said, I had them in my Luna light stick. I don't use my Luna light stick. So they should be good to go. I was wrong, 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 wrong. When a song came on, I turned it on, swinging my light stick back and forth for maybe like, I would say 30 seconds to a minute. And then I will turn it off, you know, because I'm trying to save the battery as much as I can. <laughs> so I was on and off, on and off. And then to make things worse, you guys, prior to the concert, I deleted so many things off my phone. Like I deleted a lot of pictures, like, screenshots and stuff videos i didn't need i deleted all of it and i was like i need to make sure i have space on my phone for this concert like i even told myself so i was ready i was like you know what i got this i got this 
like not even kidding you maybe two songs three two to three songs in my phone runs out of storage at this point i just wanted to cry i just oh my god i there's just like why me you know like i don't know what happened it stopped recording there in the middle of a song so i go to my gallery and start deleting all my family pictures all my family videos like off my phone i was like i don't care about this i just need twice content on my phone like i need it so bad <laughs> so i'm over here just deleting everything i don't care what it was i was just deleting 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 so i can have space on my phone so I had gave up everything and just decided to just live in the moment. The moment is gone and I can't remember anything. Like I have such a bad memory. It's not even funny. It's super, like it's so bad. Like because of my job, I have to remember so many things. So I can't really remember much about the concert. I mean, yes, I can remember some stuff, but I can't remember what the songs they performed. If I didn't have my videos, I, I can't really remember. Things were about to get worse at this point. You think that was just bad enough? There's more to the story <laughs> so it could be it could have probably been like 30 40 minutes after the concert has started and um and my sister was calling texting me like blowing up my phone just to let you know she knew that we were at the twice concert she knew she knew and she was babysitting my brothers and my sister-in-law's kids you know three kids she was babysitting them you know so we can go to the concert so she's over here calling me and texting me i i legit just i just swiped up on her i was like girl i you know what i don't know what happened i don't care like my ulties are right in front of me like you can't get none of my attention so i legit started swiping up and i blocked her because she wouldn't leave me alone so i blocked her so fast <laughs> and my brother and sister-in-law were sitting down on their phones right during the concert and i was like y'all need to get up and start you know watching the concert i don't know why you guys are on your phone <laughs> uh, just come to find out my niece had fell and passed out and my sister was freaking out and that's why she was calling and texting me but i had blocked her so i didn't read none of the messages i just didn't care because like i said i had twice was right in front of me so i just you know i had to make a decision and i chose twice <laughs> fine though she is fine she's fine nothing had nothing really bad happened to her besides she passed out <laughs> but she's okay um so tell me why like at this point like i didn't know why she was calling and texting um till like and i don't know 10 minutes passed by like i said my sister my sister-in-law my brother were on their phone and you know i didn't really pay too much attention to them because i'm jamming i'm like in the so deeply in the concert that like i zoned them out and um like in the middle of a song my brother taps me on the shoulder and he's trying to show me his phone and like the first message i see is my sister texting him that his daughter fell and passed out i put my hand up so fast i was like yeah don't even show me this right now because i am trying to have the time of my life and you guys are just bringing me down but i knew nothing seriously happened to her because if she, if something really did happen to her they would have left i probably i would have stayed it's like sorry to my niece I would have stayed in the concert if something really bad happened to her she, they could have gone you know they could have left me there i wouldn't care i would have stayed at the concert to the very end so like when he was trying to make me read like these long paragraphs and stuff between him and my sister i put on my hand i was like i'm sorry but like really not right now <laughs> twice is here like you guys need to understand it's me and twice right now like you guys like she's fine like if something was seriously wrong like there was nothing we could have done so why worry about it um, I know it sounds wrong, but you guys, like, I know nothing bad happened to her. That Because they were so calm, you know, telling me about it. And that's why I told them, like, let me know after the show because right now I want to just watch twice. Like, respectfully, though, I said, it's not the time or place for you to tell me like stuff like that right now. You guys, let me tell you how happy I was at the Twice concert. Like, I've never been happier ever in my life like seriously you guys like i started my channel off of twice videos do you guys not know like how much this meant to me like my very first k-pop video was a twice ship like to see how far i made it like to being able to see them right there is such a tr it's like a blessing like I can't tell you how happy I was like I smiled like I cried a little bit you know tears of joy like tears of joy were just coming down and I was super super blessed I started from watching them 
on my phone to seeing them live oh my god like oh i was i was just like living living in the moment it was so good like i want to cry right now because i don't know if we're gonna see them like it was so hard for me to get these tickets y'all kept promising that they'll come back they'll come back i hope they do because i'm gonna do everything in my power to get closer seats for me to see them like i'm gonna try so hard to get them i saw sana live i saw mina live i saw che live i saw all of my girls live. and you oh my god don't get me started on her vocals oh my god you guys i want to experience it again so bad so bad after the end of the concert like it was getting close probably we had like maybe three four more songs left um the girl next to me tapped me on the shoulder she's like did your batteries run out i was like yeah and she's like she had extra batteries and she gave them to me oh my god i was so happy like i didn't have any cash i didn't have anything to give her so i was like dude like let me sell you some money i was like do you have zell and she like declines like she was okay she was like just get the batteries you know she was such an angel oh my god like shout out to you that gave me the batteries at the twice concert like i will never forget that moment I, I just kept thanking her so much i was like thank you thank you thank you like this means so much for me like it was just batteries you guys and i was willing to give her anything and everything at that moment we ended up exchanging twitter and instagram and she ended up letting me know that um her space right now and so she wanted me to send her my videos and i was like of course i can send you the videos like i have no problem and so legit like in the videos that i'm going to post later on in this video is me literally like i had my hand of like over here away from my mouth uh because i was singing and i didn't want her to have my singing in the videos you can kind of hear me a little bit but like i'm over here recording this like right here and i'm singing with my candy ball and like my hand the next day was cramping up like i did this for so long like as much as i could record because my space was coming in and out like i was like home girl i got you and i was like you know i was like this and singing y'all when i tell you i was singing every song like i was fluent in korean like it was so much fun and can i tell you they sang for three hours like how crazy is that three hours like time wasn't even in the question like it didn't feel long it didn't feel short it just like it felt so right i stayed an hour after the concert had ended um to get on the merch line and just for them to be sold out basically of everything i wanted thankfully they still had this shirt i really 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 wanted the hoodie but they didn't have any more i was so so sad but i am going to show you what i bought it's over here i so badly wanted to just go back in there and get some confetti it didn't reach the third floor i was so sad like i just wanted something to take home as a souvenir you know um then i went to work to work the next day super super happy like it was a shocker because i never go to work happy like who does <laughs> and they performed the last waltz and i couldn't record a lot of it i think i got maybe 10 seconds of it before my phone ran out of more space you guys need to experience this for yourself and if you guys went to one of the twice concerts please let me know down below which one did you go to and if we went to the same atlanta concert tell me your experience at the state farm was it horrible just like mine was like it was super super bad like the staff didn't even know what was going on there was just as confused as we were they were just like you know what just stand in a line that's all they kept saying just get in a line get in a line but like which line you know we were just all trying to figure out what was happening but nobody knew what was happening I would never forget that moment. <laughs> I say that, but I don't remember the concert. <laughs> Honestly, like I remember it, but I just don't remember most of it. Finally, let me show you guys what I got. I bought the candy bong when I got the tickets because I knew they were going to sold out. So the next day I went to the K-pop store. I bought my light stick and I bought my brother's light stick. So y'all guys need to, right when you buy your tickets, y'all need to go buy. You got to go buy your light stick because they were sold out at the concert. And I also bought, I also bought this banner. I don't know if you guys can see it. Beautiful. And then if you flip it on the other side, it's the girls, all the girls. I forgot to let you guys know because I didn't capture it on camera. But the whole, everybody in the arena at the Atlanta show was chanting Jung Young's name. And she looks so happy. I hope somebody got that on camera. I haven't seen it. I haven't seen anybody get that on camera. But it was so 
amazing. Like we showed, like we showed her how much we missed and loved her at that show. Like I spent so much money. Like it's not even funny. I spent a lot of money on this concert, but it was worth it. Worth it. I bought this. Um, I bought the poster for fifteen dollars, and. And then I, I was able to get the gray hoodie, not the black one that I wanted. So I got this hoodie. My brother ended up buying me this shirt. This is the back, this is the front. This shirt I also got at the concert. And I was wearing a custom jacket that I made. Very expensive, very expensive. But I want to show you guys because I didn't take a picture of my outfit. Um, so let me start from the front. So this is my jacket. It's M for Mina. I got an M, but it could also be an M for Momo. I have ones on, this, on the little, little side over here ones and then the back in the back I have twice I could put anything as the numbers but I decided to you know make it my own and put the month that I was born in which you know I I thought it was nice if your twice concert is soon please make sure to have fun like sing dance do whatever you want in that concert because literally just like once in a lifetime experience enjoy yourself please please enjoy yourself just live your best life at this concert literally it's so worth it like everything i went through that whole entire day was honestly so worth it i would do it all over again just be able to see them if you guys are going to a concert soon buy your life stick ahead of time i'm pretty sure they're all sold out now um, but if you have a different K-pop concert you're going to go to, please buy the light stick ahead of time. Um, make sure you have space in your phone. Make sure you have extra batteries, bro. Uh, make sure you eat something too because the lines are so crazy. If you guys have already been to Twice's concert, please let me know down your experience. Was your experience as crazy as mine or did you have a better experience? Um, and yeah, that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, again, I don't know if I'm going to insert the clips in this video or I might have a second video with just the concert in it. And don't forget to like, comment down any more videos you guys want to see, and hit that subscribe button. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye!